Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we have another tutorial using my Huda Beauty Topaz whoa, Topaz Obsession Palette. Sorry, I'm blighting you guys. Yeah, I said I was gonna use it again because I wanted to see how... I just wanted to do a different look with the same palette. Is that so wrong? No. Yeah, so that's what we're doing today. So this is what it came up with. It's like full glam, really soft, but still natural. Actually, it's not that true. It's full glam, okay? Like, I went all in. I'm really sorry if I have seemed a bit off my video. Just, I guess the step got mixed up in my head. And then at one point, I think I seem a little bit lost. Yeah, other than that, before we get into the tutorial, I just want to say thank you to everyone who's been subscribing to my channel lately because the family has been growing. And I'm really, really happy about that. And you guys are really active in the comments. And I love answering you guys' comments. You guys are really, really sweet, honestly. And um, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe before you leave. If you guys want to see that tutorial, just stick around and watch the video. And yeah, so I'll get to the video now. I'm gonna start with my hair. My brows are already done. I used my Anastasia Brow Wiz with this. The tutorial will be down below if you guys want to see how I do my brows. It's pretty simple. Um, also, yeah, so I'm just gonna start with my edges. I'm gonna start with that so I have time to set while I do my makeup. I'm gonna use my Got To Be Glue, this one. I only have a sample size because I don't use gel a lot. Like, I used it last week for the first time and it lasted all week, so. Okay, so next I'm going to use some tape. I'm going to put it here to make it more clean, more crisp for this tutorial. Okay, so today we're going to use my Huda Beauty Topaz Obsession Palette. It looks like this. So I do have a review on the palette. I'm going to link it down below so if you guys missed it. So you guys know what I think about the palette. So what I'm going to do first, I'm going to use my blending brush. And I'm going to take this color here in the middle I'm gonna mix it a little bit with this I'm gonna put this in the crease So you want to keep it pretty soft. Next, I'm going to take a smaller blending brush with this. And I'm going to take that warmer brown color here. And I'm going to put it like deeper in the crease. So next, I'm gonna take a dome brush like this, and I'm gonna take that dark brown color that's right here. So you wanna go along the tape. I'm gonna go with a small blending brush, I think it will work better. And I'm gonna drag it a little bit up here in my crease. So I'm going to go back with my bigger blending brush and with this color here, just to smooth out the edges here because I find it's a bit harsh. So next I'm just taking my eyeshadow brush like this and I'm going to take that shadow here. I'm going to put it on my lid.
It looks more intense with your fingers. So I would suggest doing that. And I'm going back with my blending brush just to blend the edges here so it looks all more put together. So next, I think I'm going to take the same shadow brush. I'm just going to take the other side and I'm going to take that gold color here and then I'll put it in the inner corner. Okay, so I'm going to move on to the face. I'm just going to take off the tape. So I'm going to start with moisturizing my face with my Hydro Genius by L'Oreal. So to prime my face, I'm going to use my uh, Makeup Forever Mattifying Primer. I'm gonna mix it with my Smashbox primer. For my foundation, I'm gonna mix my Maybelline 340 Fit Me, and I'm gonna use the True Match by L'Oreal. I'm in the color C6 right now. This is my best match. So next I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer for my under eyes. I'm also going to use it for around my mouth because I find it's a bit darker here and here and here and here and my nose and everywhere. And I'm gonna mix it with my Better Skin, just under my eyes, just because this one is a bit brighter. So it gives me like a, it doesn't really give me a highlighted look, but it really hides my uh, dark circles. This is what I like about this one. I'm gonna use a dome brush like this to blend it out. So now I'm gonna set everything with my Laura Mercier translucent powder. I don't have a lot left and I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna set it with the same brush. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna set my under eyes where basically everywhere I get oily or I crease. Okay, so now I'm gonna carve my cheeks because I wanna put some bronzer. Okay, I'm just gonna use my Bobbi Brown because I don't want my Anastasia next to me. I wanted to use something new, but Bobbi Brown it is. I'm gonna color deep, by the way. In case you guys wanted to know. Now I'm gonna use, what am I doing now? Uh, put a little bit of blush 
I'm gonna use my MAC Sweet As Coco blush. I'm gonna use a blush brush. So we're just gonna go back to the eyes. So I'm gonna do my lower lash line, lashes, and all that good stuff. So going back to the eyes, I'm gonna take my palette again. I'm going to take an angle brush. Yeah, I'm gonna take an angle brush like this, and I'm gonna take um, this color and this color mixed together, and I'm just gonna drag it all the way through the lash line. I'm just gonna leave this part out because I wanna put the gold color in the inner corner. So I'm gonna take my blend brush, I'm not gonna add more product and I'm just gonna smoke it out a little bit and see how it goes if I feel like I need more product I'm just gonna add more which is gonna be this one here it's really to your liking just smoke it out like this see I didn't even add product and it's really really smoked out so I'm not gonna add anything more And next, I'm taking another angle brush like this. I'm gonna take that gold color here. I'm gonna do it my under eye. Um, this shadow here is really this fallout. So just be careful if you wanna mess. You don't wanna mess your whole makeup. I'm seriously debating if I do a wing liner or not. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do a wing liner, but a really thin, thin one because I like the eyes the way they are. So, hopefully I don't fuck it up. Okay, I'm gonna do it off camera because <sighs> I'm scared. Okay, so I did my liner with my Kat Von D Trooper liquid liner. You can see it's like really, really thin. It's just so to have dimension, I guess. And I did put some uh, pencil liner. It's my L'Oreal Cranberry Black Extra Intense Liquid Pencil Eyeliner. Yeah. And now I'm gonna put some uh, mascara. I'm gonna use my telescopic mascara in Car Carbon Black. I'm gonna use the same one for my lower lash line. My lower lashes. Wow. So now I'm gonna do my lips. And I think I'm gonna do a nude, brownish nude lip. I don't really know. So first, I'm gonna use my Sable Brown liner. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna keep it really simple. I'm just gonna put some gloss. I just bought the butter gloss. Like, I never used butter glosses before, and I really, really like it. I've been using it for like a week now. And it's the color Tiramisu. For highlight, I'm gonna use my... I feel like I'm all over the place. I'm really sorry if I seem off today. I feel like I'm all over the place, I don't know. So, for highlight, I'm gonna use my Maybelline Master Chrome Highlighter in Molten, Molten Gold. So this is gonna be my base, because you guys know I like to mix my highlights. I'm just gonna put it on my nose, right in the middle here. On my cheeks. For my second highlight, I think I'm gonna use my 
the Cool Girl palette. I'm gonna use the color Glow Getter. Since we went full glam, I guess I'll use one that's really, really reflective. So I'm gonna use the same brush. So it looks like this. So it's this color here. So I'm gonna go do put on my lashes, do my hair off camera, and I'll be back with the final results. Okay guys, so this is a finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know I seemed a little bit off my video. Um, I guess I was just like, at one point I just didn't know what step to do next and I was just like, I seemed a bit lost, I guess, it happens. But my makeup turned out great and I really enjoyed it. I hope you guys like don't mind that I used the same palette that I used before. Anyways, I said I was gonna use it again because you guys know me. I use some palettes twice, even sometimes three times, just because you wanna see like where you can go with a palette. You don't wanna just, just do one look, you want ideas, right? I mean, we don't have all that money to get palettes over palettes over palettes all the time. So get your money's worth, you know? Yeah, that's all I wanna say. Um, By the way, my lashes are number 11 by Kiss. You can find them at the drugstore. They're really really cheap they come in a pack of like eight or i don't know six i'm not sure eight ten five pairs five pairs yeah i think i bought mine like a year ago i don't put lashes that often so it lasts really long so if you like the video don't forget to put a like down below <clears throat> don't forget to put a like down below if you like the video leave some comments because you guys know i love your comments i always answer my comments and i like to like respond to you guys if you guys need information or anything i'm always there um i always respond first thing when i see it even if you guys just want to say hello i'll be like hey girl well hey guy and i'll be like hello okay you guys can always do that look if you guys do it let me know send some pictures on my social media by the way all my social media are down below if you guys want to follow me on instagram i'm mostly on instagram and twitter i don't really use snapchat anymore so if you guys want to hit me up we can talk you know I don't mind. I really don't mind. Don't forget to subscribe. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Because the family's growing and we chill. Okay? It's really nice around here. Okay? No drama, no nothing. It's really nice around here. So I wanna guys I wanna see you guys back. If you guys are not new, it's it's fine. Just stick around. Don't go anywhere, okay? So yeah, I'll see you back next week. With another video yeah i'll see you next week guys bye